and welcome to Wani's house today guys I'm bringing you um, a relatively small haul I've been out there looking in these streets and I found some interesting things I took advantage of the Hobby Lobby 90% off sale didn't get a much get a lot there but I did get some a couple of cute things and I also took advantage of um, something for Hobby Lobby's 75% off sale. I've gone to Dollar Tree, TJ Maxx, and the at-home store. So like I said, it's not a lot of things, but I did get some fabulous items. So with no further ado, let me show you what I picked up. So a lot of the things that I actually picked up are for Puda's apartment. And her bed frame still hasn't come in. It is on back order. And so I have some other things that I'm com that are coming in from a collaboration. So we will be working on another area in her place until her bed frame come. And then I'm looking for two nightstands. And I think I'm gonna take a trip to my um, hotel retailer because I saw something on there that piqued my interest. So I'll be taking you along with me there. And while I'm talking about Poodles and Poodles apartment, I want to thank my um, YouTube mother, Miss Mary. Miss Mary, I need to call you um, and tell you thank you. We received um, the gift card that you sent Poodle for home from was it Home Goods? Or I can't. I think it was Home Goods. And so she got it. So thank you very very much. She used it. And she purchased, um, it was at TJ Maxx, it was TJ Maxx Home Goods and um, Marshalls. So she bought herself a really cute comforter set. Um, and I'm going to put it here because she's already put it on her bed. She said thank you very, very much. And she loved um, the card. So thank you. I had intentions on thanking you a couple of videos ago. And I kept saying, don't forget to do it. Don't forget to do it. So I did not forget to do it, but I am going to call you. So by the time you see this, I would have called you. But I wanted to thank you publicly for sending her that. And she wanted to, me to tell you thank you very much and that she loves her comforter set. Okay. So um, going forward, um, so the things I'm about to show you are actually for Puda. And they are going to her apartment. And so what I have been doing, guys, you guys know that I am in the process of painting Poodle's old room and I am going to make her room my office and then my current office is going to be the guest bedroom because her room is actually longer and wider than my office, that the room that my office is currently in. And I think that I can compartmentalize the room for my needs um, um, regarding work, my channel, and the things that I do over here at Wani's house. So I'm in the process right now of um, the early processes of getting things out and throwing things away and taking things to the goodwill. And so I'm also in the process of shopping my home for items to take over to her place to decorate her space. That's the good thing about having a mom who is um, like um, a shopaholic, not really, but who shops a lot and I can catch a deal. And so going through my, my house, I realized there are a lot of, there are a couple of things that would look great in her space as far as decor pieces. And there will really um, 
enhance the spaces that we'll be working in. So I've taken some, um, taken the liberty of going through my stash as I am purging a lot of the things that I have and taking them to Goodwill. You see, I've been going to Goodwill. I've been going to the uh, Recycle Center. I have been doing that almost every weekend and I plan on doing it again this weekend. I have to, you know, get rid of stuff. Things I haven't used or touched in years. I haven't, well, we haven't entertained. So there's a lot of things that is just sitting here. So I am getting rid of them. But um, there's some things that I have that will look great in her space. So, and I'll probably put a little cutout so you can see some of the things that I have set, sit, set to the side for her. So what I'm gonna show you first, and I'm gonna show you the things that are for her, and then I'm gonna share with you um, the things that are for me, okay? Which isn't a lot. So we're gonna go Hobby Lobby, and this was purchased for on um, during the, I think it was the 75, it was 75, 5% off sale and I thought it was so cute and I had saw it other times when I was in there but it only looked attractive to me when it was 75% off and it's this container right here and this is made of like a, a jute type of material like a straw type of material it is so cute I love the little black accent right here I love the black it's like yarn accent here, and I love the shape. So this, it, the top comes off, and this is what it looks like on the inside. And um, so, you know, she can put like little miscellaneous type things on this. Um, and so you'll, be, you'll see how and where I will be using this, and I think it's gonna look amazing in the space. But yes, this price was, $2.99 so if it was 90% off it would have been $2.99 but it was 75% off so I think it, it it may have been $5 I don't have the receipt here but I believe it was around $5 so it wasn't a lot of money um, compared to the $29.99 let me see if this is that No, this isn't that one. Okay, so anyway, I got this. I know, I think this was, this ended up being $7. $7.50, I believe. I believe that's what this is, so it was $7.50, okay? So I got that for her. And then I went to the 70 the 90% off sale and um, picked up her a couple of things. Now, initially I thought, huh, maybe you can get these and do a little spray, um, spray painting technique on them. But now that I'm thinking about it, I probably won't. But let me show you what I got. So the first item that I have is this vase here. Now it's like this real cute smoke um, gray vase. Very, very cute. I love the details here. So initially I thought, why don't you spray paint this black, right? And then over this part, the raised part, I thought about doing using like a sponge or something and kind of going over it and highlighting that part in gold. You know, that is my, that is my thing, that is my aesthetic. But I, looking at her place, I think it might do better just staying this, um, the natural shade right, like it is right now. And I think it'll look great in what I plan on doing. So the price of this originally was $21.99. So I got it for $2.99, okay? That was good, okay? I thought that was excellent. And then, they had a smaller one that I had to have. 
because of course we need the parent and this is this one now this one was at 75 percent off it was four dollars and this was 19.99 so i paid a dollar 99 for this so these are both of these together and um it's gonna look really nice it's gonna look so um beautiful i believe once i put them in her space so we're waiting on some things to come in and then we will be headed back to Huda's house hopefully they come in before um she goes out of town she's going to disney for her birthday so um hopefully we can get this done before then um, this is in a couple of weeks fingers crossed all right and so while i was at hobby Lobby, i did buy one more thing it wasn't for Puda. it was actually for my my co-worker she loves cats she is like the cat lady i think she has like three cats and she has two dogs also but she loves cats and so i saw this mug here and i thought it was so cute for her and so i picked it up and it was 9.99 so this was actually 99 cent this is what the top what the what it looks like hopefully there you go isn't that cute i picked out the the white one and it has the gold accents y'all know that is so me but i think she would love this so i intended on taking it to her um this week but i forgot about it so i will take it and put it in her office with a card because she's been having family issues and so i, I thought that would be really cute for her she comes in the office and she sees that with a little card okay so those were actually all the items that i picked up for poodle told you it wasn't a lot at all so let me show you what i got for myself once again it's not a lot but it's enough to share with you guys you know why because i tell you everything so i went to the at home store at home store i actually took my mom there we just walked through there to see what they had and you know the at home store every now and then they'll bring in something new now i really want to go in there because you know i love the fall picks you cannot find any better picks than at the at home store now that being said when you get there you need to get what you're going to get because soon everybody's going to be be there and everything is going to be picked over but they have the um the most bang for your buck you cannot beat it even on a lot of the items when hobby lobby put their floors and things on sale you're not going to beat the quantity of what you're going to get at the hat home store than what you're going to get at hobby lobby so i went through there didn't see anything i did pick up pick picks up and then i decided not to get them because i wasn't sure about the colors but now i know about the color i'm gonna go back and get them but one thing i saw were these this cute little box here isn't this adorable it is a cute little storage box and it has the little leather detail you guys know i used the faux leather last year for the fall and um i will be using elements of it again this year now right now at target they have the cutest little vase similar to one of the this vase here that i have and then around the perimeter it has leather i picked it up put it down picked it up put it down it's in the bullseye playground y'all it's only five dollars but i keep going back and forth as to if it is going to fit my space i don't know i don't know but for five dollars i probably should go ahead and get it and um even if i don't use it this year i will have it to use in upcoming years because i'm going to use the faux leather again we'll see and they have it in like a clear glass and they have it in um <clears throat> like a orangey colored glass similar to this and um both of them are absolutely gorgeous mm, thinking about it but anyway at the at home store saw this and this was five i'm sorry 5.99 and you're like why do you pay five dollars for a box yes i did because I like the, I mean, I like this. 
I mean, it's so simple and it is really just a box with a piece of leather. And, uh, um, and originally it is supposed to go like for like office storage, right? And then I picked up the larger one. Now this one was $9.99. Once again, it's nothing but a black box with a piece of leather on it. But guys, when you put it like this, look at that. Isn't that cute? That is cute. Two boxes. Girl, why do you think of that? Girl, why do you think of that? Two boxes with um, a piece of cut leather and a, like a little grommet right here. That's all that was. I paid $14 for that. I really could have probably made it myself, but I have too much to do around here. Another DIY was not in the books, but this is very cute. So you will be seeing this decorated in my space very very soon all right so like i stated though these two boxes with the leather accents are from the at home store all right so i was if you guys watched my video and we went when i was in indianapolis and i took you to the um tj maxx that was um across the street from my hotel how convenient <laughs> but God was speaking to me he said put her here so I was at the TJ Maxx and I we did the walkthrough and I was showing you all the pre-fall things that they had now one of the things that I was that I saw that I wish I could have gotten and it was this white bowl and it, it had this faux moss arrangement in there it was gorgeous i shared it with you guys um i think i still have the footage if i do i'll put it right here and i told you that i was going to be and i told you guys that i was going to be on the lookout for it here in atlanta didn't find it i went to every tj max marshall's home goods looking for this could not find it so um, this past week I went into TJ Maxx because I want to do something for my tablescape. That was my idea that I wanted to be a part of a centerpiece for my tablescape. And since I couldn't find it, I wanted to improvise. And um, so I was looking and looking and I saw some bowls and I just didn't want just like a white bowl. And I was like, mm. so couldn't find anything. And as I was beginning to walk out the door, I saw these vessels and instantly fell in love. So I picked up three of them. Now I'm almost convinced that when you look at the packaging there that was on it, it was supposed to be two. It was a, this one and then a smaller one. But I don't know what happened to the smaller ones with this, but they, it was on clearance. And it's this right here. So this is actually a planter. This comes out this is the bottom of it so it's actually two pieces so it's actually two pieces so i can use this like this and could possibly put um a candle in here and have that on the table oh that's a good idea did not think about that one or i can just put this back on the inside like it is here and then have the the moss in here and i thought about that but i have another idea that you will be seeing coming up um soon when we decorate the um my dining room area for for um for fall well it'll be pre-fall but i also when i saw this i was like girl you could spray paint this i thought about maybe putting like um some spray paint and um well, taping this off and taping the other half off and having a gold um, stripe going through it. I thought about that. I thought about painting it all gold. I thought about painting it black. I think it would look very chic black. So many things have gone through my mind, but I think that um, I might keep it white. I don't know. What do you guys think? What do you guys think about this? I think this is so unique. And once again, this is what it looks like with the insert. And then this is what it looks like here. So it is actually a planter. So 
I picked up three of these and I have another one down at the bottom at $8 a piece. I was like, girl, if you don't get this, you are going to be so upset at yourself. And um, I played with them on the table and you know, because I was like, if it doesn't work, I can take it back. So I played with it on the table and I think it's gonna work. I think you're gonna love it. <laughs> but you have to come back here and you have to be subscribed to my channel to see how all that comes together. Because if you don't know, and if just your first time here, I do amazing tablescapes. <laughs> you didn't know? I do amazing tablescapes. Those are my forte. I love entertaining. And this is the time that I can really, like, this is the time I can bring out all of my my toys that's why i call my plates and dishes and glasses and all of my silverware i can come and bring it out and i can really be creative in my space that's my element y'all i'm gonna put a couple of pictures here so you can see what i've done in the past don't play so um i got that all right and then um so that was all that i got from tj maxx i just didn't i came i, I saw I purchased it was that easy so I'm going through Dollar Tree stopping at Dollar Tree for some reason don't know what it was and um, wait a minute yeah I'm going through Dollar Tree and now that Dollar Tree is not a dollar and a quarter um, she has to really um, watch how she goes in there and spins because I must say for that quarter They have definitely um up the quality the quality of the items items in there And I'm gonna show you some things that I saw over here because Dollar Tree but I had some pumpkins guys that have like a glam element They were so cute once again You know I almost bought poodle pumpkins to go over there. I don't know what's my thing with the pumpkins I almost bought poodle some pumpkins and I was like, girl, cut it out. Stop it. Because it's not only her apartment. Y'all know she has a roommate and I don't want her roommate to think, oh my goodness, her mom just coming over doing the doggone thing. But um, I did I did see the pumpkins and I saw a couple of other things that I'm going to post. And, um, if you saw the reels that I put out um, on my Instagram, you would have seen the pumpkins. But while I was in there, I came across these beauties right here. Now, they had them in orange. They had them in this light color here. They had them in this color. And they also have it, I think it's a darker color. Is it this one? No. It's another color. Maybe I didn't get it. It's a darker color. And um, I thought these were adorable. These are so cute. Now, Target. Target has pumpkins about the same size, made out of the same materials. Um, and it's just the pumpkin for $5. A dollar and a quarter has it for what? A <laughs> dollar and a quarter. So this right here is just, let me take this out. It's just on a stem. There we go. It's just on a stem. And push this back in. There we go. This is it. This is so cute. So cute. And so I picked up three, four, and um and i picked up two for poodle's place because i am doing that area so these are mine these are mine and the other two are hers for her place and um yeah but these are so cute so cute so i just had to get them i was like because i was about to spend $15 for three of them at Target. And I've gotten three of these for um, what $3.75, girl, please. Don't play. Um, 
a dollar twenty five the dollar twenty five store y'all got it yeah you got my money and I saw some other stuff didn't get any of that I had to restrain myself you don't need no more pumpkins no more pumpkins that's like um and uh, mommy dears no more wire hangers no more pumpkins y'all y'all know your girl's special anyway so that's it that is all for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed me sharing with you guys um what i picked up from for poodle's place particularly and as well as my space if you did enjoy this i would appreciate it if you would go ahead and hit that subscribe button along with the notification bell so that you won't miss out on any of my upcoming uploads also come on over and check me out on my instagram you can find me over there at wani's house hit the follow button and then you'll be in the know as to what is to come over here at wani's house also come on over and check me out on my Amazon store is linked down in the description box below over there I have placed all of the items um, that I have purchased from Amazon that I absolutely love and some other things that I have my eye on that are from home decor to hers you know your girl like a good her um, hers earrings shoes sunglasses whatever your heart's desire i have it down at my amazon store so go on over and check me out all right guys so that's all i have i'm about to go but before i do you know what i always say the next time you're in town you can always stop by Wani's house and i'll see you in the next video bye bye